Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Nidhi and today's video is all about color corrections and different kinds of concealer. So if you are interested in knowing everything about it, then please keep on watching. I have a concealer palette which looks like this and it has so many colors and if you guys are just wondering what all of them are for, that is what we will be talking about in this video. Uh, let's start with the green color concealer. So the green cancels out any kind of redness on your face be it around your nose or your pimple redness or anything of that sort so it will just cancel out any kind of redness that you have I personally like to apply all the color correction and everything before I do my foundation so that the foundation just covers everything really nicely and my skin looks absolutely flawless a peach color or a salmon color uh, concealers are good to cancel out any kind of darkness be it your under eyes or around your mouth so do a bit of color correction if you have darkness like a black uh, patch or something of that kind on your face a peach color or a salmon color concealer is amazing to just cancel that out purple lilac or lavender color concealer just like these are good to cancel out any kind of yellow undertones onto your face it brings out a glow from within so these are really good to just cancel out any kind of yellow undertones on your face and just glow from within so yeah that was all about the colors different colors that can be used as concealer you then we come to a color range of colors right here these are basically the yellow concealers or the actual concealers that we always use to just cover up our dark circles or spots or blemishes and everything of that sort so you need to just identify the color that is just matching to your skin tone. Yellow concealer should always be at least one or two shades lighter than your skin tone so as to brighten up your skin tone. So when you uh, do color correction with a peach color on your under eyes, apply a shade which is, apply a yellow concealer shade which is one or two shades lighter than you and then just apply it over the color correction that you have done. So I'll just insert a demo of how I do concealing and color correction on my face as to give you an idea of uh, how you can do it on your face since you can see I do not have any kind of redness on my face so I'll not do the color correction with the green color but I do have a lot of dark pigmentation under my eyes and around my nose and also a bit on my around my mouth so I'll just color correct with the peach color you can if you don't have a concealer of peach color you can even use a orange lipstick for that purpose but rather than using a color corrector you can use a orange lipstick as well while using the orange color do not overdo it and just tap it with your finger uh, so as to just blend it into your skin because if you apply too much of it it will just show up through your concealer and your foundation which won't look nice and it might just make your foundation and your concealer cakey as well so I'm just applying a bit of it under my eye I'm not going to do it for this eye so that you guys can just make out a difference of with color correcting I've already applied some on my around my nose around my mouth and under my eyes you can already make a difference like this is a bit orange and this one is still yellow and black I'm going uh, with the MUA stick concealer in medium and I'm just going to apply it on the places where I have done color correction so I'll just apply it into an inverted triangle shape this is very much close to my skin tone but it is one shade lighter to my skin tone if you guys can see that so I'm just going to apply it into the inverted triangle shape do not overdo it I'll also take this a little bit on my eye around my nose wherever I have applied the orange corrector and then I'm taking a beauty blender this is a damn beauty blender and I will just blend it out look at this 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 one has now a even skin tone and this one you can see the darkness right here another way to cover your dark circles is use a concealer matching to your skin tone first and then use a concealer which is lighter to your skin tone so what I am going to do I'm going to take this concealer which is exactly matching to my skin tone so I'll just apply this under my eye see it already just cancelled out all the darkness from my under eye area and then I'm just 
gonna take this shade which is a shade lighter to my skin tone and I will just apply that on top of this so as to just brighten that area. Now just look at how my dark circles are all concealed. You cannot see the darkness right here now. This is the one with the peach corrector and then the concealer and this is the one all with concealer. First coat of my skin tone and then with the tone lighter than my skin tone and it just completely covered the dark circle. Look at that. I'll also apply the concealer which is lighter to my skin tone. On the bridge of my nose so as to just brighten it up. And on my cupid's bow and just below where my contours will be. All these spaces need to be a bit brightened up so I'm just using a concealer which is lighter to my skin tone on this area and then just blend it all out with the help of my beauty blender. Yeah, with that I finished my color correction and my concealing. Um, I'll just apply the foundation and come. I hope that video was helpful to you and if it was then do not forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you in my next one. Till then take care. Bye.